Okay guys, hello. So this is going to be a little different video. Um, so I know a lot of you follow me, but some of you are, I've got a lot of new subscribers. So I kind of wanted to do this for my new subscribers. Okay, a lot of people are, <laughs> that are already been here for a while, they know I am crazy. I'm just trying to make room so when I show you guys this, there's plenty of room. So, um, I am a crazy crafter, like, I have everything, um, no, this is not a brag video, this was something that somebody's, like, asked me if I like, and I'm like, oh, do I like, I hoard this, <laughs> so, <laughs> that's why I'm cleaning my desk off, so I can show you guys what I am going to show you, so you guys, everybody knows um Tim Holtz he is amazing I absolutely love Tim Holtz um everything absolutely everything so um somebody had asked me and it's Carrie here on uh YouTube she is um glue gun something I think glue gun roses I think I know that's what she is on Instagram so she asked me, me and her, um, in January, we do a Think Outside the Box, which I'm super excited about this month because this month's words are pretty cool. <clears throat> so I'm excited about it. And she asked me if I liked Tim Holtz because I love shimmy, shabby chic. And that's my thing is shabby chic, vintage, pink, girly love flowers so i'm like yeah i like tim holtz so this video is to show carrie what i hoard of tim holtz so let's get into it so i have i love tim holtz i absolutely love him so let me first off show you I cannot find the little scissors of Tim Holtz, but I have the big ones, and I have the medium-sized ones. I just need the small ones, but I can't seem to find them, so, yeah. And also, in his tools, I have the little stapler. The only thing I don't have is the platform, which I... I don't know if I'm going to get it because I really like my Stamp Perfect. Like, I started out with getting the Stamp Perfect when it came out, guys, and I absolutely love it. So, I don't know if I'm going to get the platform. But, this is my Tim Holtz collection. You guys, this is so insane. This thing is so big, like... I can't even get all of the box in here like <laughs> it's so big and this is called my magical trunk me and Brittany got this at Tuesday morning so I'm just gonna share with you guys let me put it on my lap so that way I can show you guys how in love with Tim Holtz I am so anytime me and Brittany find the corners because they're kind of hard to find sometimes we grab them so, I love those. Now, this was something new at our Joanne's that we hadn't seen. So, we grabbed them. They're little charms. And these are like word phrases. They're called word bands. And then these are quote bands. I love quotes. You guys know that. I love quotes. Um, these were gifted to me, I think. These are card frames. There's five of them in there. I hoard them. Um, I do believe these were gifted to me too. These are the vellum packs. I have lots of ephemera packs of Tim Holtz, but I don't have that one. That was something that somebody had found. So here's another one of those. See, I get so much that I don't realize I have. So there's another one. Here's some smaller corners. You guys, we've been collecting in this box for a long time. So don't just think that it's just stuff that we've had. Or just got, because it's not. This is another thing that I, every time I see them, I grab them. Because these are good for making junk journals. Ah, 
Oh my god. I'm so sorry, guys. This trunk's huge, so my lab. So Miss Lizette had um, gifted me lots of Tim Holtz stuff, and that was in it. These are something that me and Brittany had done a class on one time, and we never finished the project. So I wish we would have, because it was really cool. But we didn't. So these are loop pins. I, you guys know what these are, I'm sure. These are good for charms and junk journals. <clears throat> we have some Tim Holtz buttons. See, I find them on sale when I grab them. Um, these are some knobs, custom knobs. And they're literally knobs, you guys. And you can put whatever you want on them. So those are cool. I'm thinking these came from Miss Lizette, too. It's uh, clocks. Um, here's some hangers. I thought those were the cutest. I do believe that these came from Miss Lizette, too. She sent me a lot of Tim Holtz stuff, you guys. So awesome. Of course, we have the Buckle Brads. These are so cute. We have the Nature Lake. You can glue these on things, and these are really cool. Um, let's see. We have these. These are cool for when you're making free or albums and books here is there's two of those so I got two of those oh my gosh no I got three of those you guys I'm telling you it's crazy the Tim Holtz crayons but this is why I wanted to show her yes I love Tim Holtz Look how cute those are. I think these came from Miss Lizette, too. Very, very cute. There's more of those things. I'm telling you, I grab those every time I see them. There's some of the buttons I've actually... I use some of the stuff. I do use it. These are little heart charms, and you it's got a bunch of different things you put in it. And these ones are the circles where you can put the initials. Here's the ephemera. That's why I was trying to keep the ephemera together because you guys, there's lots of ephemera. So Lizette did send me this. It's a mini lantern and it actually lights up, you guys. It really works. I'm going to use that for a special project. There's two uh, corners. Um, there's some more of those. Here is some gem clips. These are so stinking cute. Love those. And I like to use these when I'm doing projects. These are film strips. And I thought I had another one in here. And I probably do as we get down. We're not even close. Um, these are hinge clips. I love these in journals. I thought I had, yes, I have a couple of these. These are cameo frames. And they got the domes with them, too, so you can put the domes right in them, too. There's some more of those things in those. So, some of this I've got doubles and triples, but it's okay. Um, little tokens. How cute are those, right? There's See, I use them, guys. See? <laughs> um, I kind of went crazy when this came out, and I don't know why, but I did. And I bought a bunch of these. I think I've shared a couple too. These are really cool. Um, we got the forks, knives, and spoons. Brittany had to have those. So funny. We got some gears. We got these word bands. These are one of the first ones, like the collection. There's, I think, one of each. There might be two of each. Not sure. It looks like one though. Um, I kind of went crazy and bought a bunch of these foundation legs because I thought I was going to do a bunch of different projects with them. So I was picking them up for a while, and yeah. So Carrie, maybe I'll share a couple of those with you. And then here's a couple. These are really nice Tim Holtz frames. A lot of this is metal. That's what's cool. Like, this is all my metal collection of Tim Holtz. Here is the long fasteners. These are Brad's. These are transparent tiles. 
And these are really cool for like a ruler binding. This so would be neat for a book. And then these are ruler pieces. I don't know. I got them probably on sale or something, I'm sure. Um, I love these. This is an extra pack that I have. I use these to make chunk charms. And then stars. Here's some more charms. Gears. And now we're getting into ephemera and stuff. So let me show you first off. Okay. So you see these old vintage pictures. So I buy these and these are good to go when you make junk journals. So I do use those. And then I have the photo booth ones. These are really cool to stick in.